The final days of World War II may prove to be the bloodiest. Soviet troops reach the heart of the Third Reich, Berlin. The Red Army prepares to launch an assault near the iconic Brandenburg Gate in the heart of Berlin. If they succeed, the war is all but won for the Allies. This is the time for bravery and absolutely no retreat. The fate of the war and the blah, oh god and the freedom of the world are about to be decided. Uh, the war in Europe ends here today. Woohoo! Brasca I think I just had a stroke. Let's get into it. All right, gamers, we're here in Brass Brigade, the Battle of Berlin, baby. New update. I'm so hyped. This game is one of my favorites of the year it's it's been great the regular updates have been so nice the developer a, a a single developer an absolute legend making these updates regularly for us us common gamers gotta love it gotta love the work he puts into this thank you so much man big shout out to him uh and big shout out to you guys for watching the video if you guys enjoy brass brigade be sure to hit the like button subscribe if you haven't already and comment on down below either way ooh, i just got shot where from okay i don't know i do not know okay we're fine for now murder the germans yes okay the red army is pushing on forward here in the race for berlin i think we're, we're gonna beat those uh those bloody westerners we're gonna beat those Americans. We're gonna beat those uh, British to Berlin. Well, we're already at Berlin. We just need to take it now. And there I go. We did do a nice little streak right there, but it ended up not being enough. We couldn't. We couldn't make it. Let's switch up uh, the troopers. Let's try out conscript. Obviously, probably not a very powerful trooper, but hey, it'd be interesting to give it a good old college try here, don't you guys think? Um, all right, I'm gonna recruit some soldiers here in my radius, and then follow me, fellas. Come on, boys. Let's get it. I love that feature of this game. Not something I use very often because, quite frankly, I like to be a solo warrior. But it is kind of cool when you can, like, gather a nice little squad up and uh, make some stuff happen. Do some epic pushes. You know how it be. Okay, we do have a German Panzer over there. Um, yeah, reload my grenade, please. Um, I don't know if it's going to actually do all that much against this German Panzer. But, uh, hey, I'll take whatever I can get. There you go, grenading out again. We're getting shot in the booty, though. Come on, Mosin Nagant. Oh, they keep dropping on the ground. I think the AI must have gotten an update or something, because normally they'll just stand and fight, but now they're actually dropping to the ground when they take incoming fire, which is really cool. It's like a cool, like, get-to-cover style of, uh, you know, programming right there. I really like that. That's neat. All right, we're just going to reload here. They have Panzerfausts over there. Oh, no, no, no. Oh, yeah, okay, I did not have the proper weaponry to be taking on a tank plus a bunch of infantry. It just wasn't going to happen there, and it didn't happen, believe it or not. <laughs> All right, let's try out the Rocketeer. Uh, we did end up taking the checkpoint here, which is pretty nice. Uh, so that means we can just sort of spawn here now, and it's easy peasy. And boom! That was a good hit, good frontal hit. Uh, you know, prefer the engine hits, but it, it is what it is, boys. There we go! Blowing you sky high. Get punked. Get absolutely wrecked. You absolute novice of a player. There we go. Just just rocket launching everyone I can. Ooh, there's the gates. There is the gates. Comrade, commandant. All right, I'm going to take out the old rifle here. Beautiful. Is this an SVT? I think it might be. Ow. I keep getting shot. I'm just going to hide. Um, Can you guys stop spawning here? That's a sick grenade. Okay. Okay. Woo. Okay, we're fine. Everything is fine. Just epic. Okay, there we go. Ooh, we're good. We're good, baby. And then I just get kersploded. <laughs> that tiger tank meant business. <laughs> he just popped out of nowhere and hit me with the one-two kapuya punch. Oh my lordy lordy. Oh my lordy lordy. All right, guys, let's spawn back on in here. So I just did something really stupid with my money, and I decided I needed to uh, play some video games in order to uh, forget about the amount of money I just spent. I just spent $1,500 on three Pokemon card packs. Um, if you guys have ever watched TCA Gaming, uh, he's an absolute legend in the Pokemon community. I've been a part of the Pokemon community as a collector for the past, like, four years. Um... I don't talk about it too much. Every once in a while, I'll do, like, a box opening video or, like, 
on Daily and Lion, I showed off parts of my collection and stuff. Uh, but yeah, I've been in it since 2016, been a collector, but I've rarely opened vintage packs. Um, that's something that I, I would love to do more of, but just I, I've never gotten the chance because it, it costs so much money to do. Um, and so I've actually opened, I've opened one base set pack. Uh, it was the Blastoise artwork. Um, my own man just shoot me? Okay. All right, dude. Um, it was the Blastoise artwork. That was really fun. Didn't get a hollow out of that. I've also opened four jungle booster packs. Uh, if you are familiar with the Pokemon sets, uh, that was five years ago or whatever it was, 2016. That was in 2016 when packs did not cost this much. Um, and so that was cool. Again, did not get any hollows, which was a little bit disappointing, but it eased what it eased, boys. Is that dead alive? No, I don't think so. Okay, we're good. Um, so those are the only like vintage, vintage packs I've ever opened. I've ever had the, the honor of opening. So I decided I would hit up TCA Gaming, a legend in the Pokemon community, um, and see, you know, what his pack prices were. And he told me that he had uh, three of the, um, if you guys are familiar with uh, Neo Genesis, that's a very cool set. He had three Neo Ge Genesis packs unweighed, uh, which unweighed means that, uh, you know, you could have like a holographic card in it, which is, you know, important. That's obviously what you want. Ooh, artillery strike over there, very cool. Um, and so I was like, all right, you know what? I'll bite, dude, let's do it. Um, and uh, he was selling them for 550 a piece. Um, I managed to get him to do 1500 for all three. Uh, so I got a little bit of a deal there. Um, he, he was a very nice guy, very swell guy. I really appreciate him. Uh, and so I am eagerly awaiting the video of him opening up my packs, uh, and then he'll send them on over to me. Um, if I if I manage to pull a Lugia, I am in the money, like thousands of dollars, thousands of dollars. If he pulls a Typhlosion, similar situation. If he pulls like a Feraligatr, Meganium, you know, I'm I'm still good. I'm still good. If he pulls no Hollows, I am very bad. We are very bad. We are we are lucky if we get our money back if he pulls uh, zero Hollows for me. But uh, we're hoping for some Hollows. We're hoping to make our money back. But I really decided I would do it now because the prices of these you know card packs they are, they are only going to go up um, at this point. Uh, the the hobby is so large and they are becoming more and more vintage and with every card pack opened up There's you know one less in stock because obviously uh, You know Pokemon is still producing them. So I decided if if this was you know uh, Going to be the lowest point that these packs would ever cost then I wanted to do it now um, You know and, and go all out and if I if I do it and I and I get some good cards I'll be happy um, even if I just get commons and I grade them, I can still get a lot of my money back, so I'm not too worried about that either. Um, but, uh, you know, I am I am excited. I really want to see what we end up getting here. And uh, it, it's just the one time I, I think, oh my god, what is happening? I'm just going to throw that out there. I died, dang it. But we did get the dynamite out. That could blow up and uh, destroy these guys. Uh, I don't even know if it did. <laughs> But yeah, uh, I, I'm so excited guys. I am so excited about this. I think it's gonna be so sick um, I, I can't wait to see what I end up pulling uh, and uh, you know This has been something I've been wanting to do for a while I wish I had done it a few years ago when Pokemon wasn't so expensive, but live and learn we're doing it now and uh, I'll, Maybe I'll, I'll do a reaction video of the the polls or something along those lines that could be kind of neat That could be kind of fun who knows? Who knows what we'll end up doing? But uh, I can't wait. E regardless, it's gonna be fun. It's gonna be very fun. Ah! These Germans! They are all over the place! What are you doing? This is actually a beautiful map, I gotta say. I am really, really digging my time on this map. This might be one of his best maps he's ever made. I also like how a lot of the boxes and things are completely destructible and things like that. Not to mention, like, the, the close- oh, I was almost about to shoot at my own men. The close quarters fighting is some of the best we've ever seen. This- this is a truly epic- Oh, the officer was hiding in there! This is a truly epic map. I, and the, the intense close quarters, high conflict fighting, very dope. Very pog. I- I- yeah, this is- this is a dream come true right here. This is epic. I love it. I love it. Alright, come on. Can we- Make it in here. Please. Let's push it on up. Oh! 
Dude, I just keep getting shot. All right, I think if we land a grenade right where these jabronis are, we might be able to uh, to make something happen here. Or maybe we go support with the, the machine gun, you know? We try our luck with this. Oh, there's also a German spawn point over this way. Wait, that didn't kill him? I thought he had died. All right. Machine gunner. There we go. Not bad. Okay, take cover right here. All right, now we push in. All right, we're going to go first person mode, baby. And I get blasted in the face. Are you kidding me right now, dude? Oh, we are on the struggle bus, boys. We are on the struggle bus. The bus of struggle. That's where we are. That's where we reside. <laughs> oh my god. All right. Are they spawning over there? No, okay. We captured that. Ooh, we captured that as well, actually. So is it really just over here that we need to cap? All right, that's an allied sniper. I love how, like, everyone's in the buildings and stuff. It's so cool watching, like, our, our teammates go, like, go the building, firing alongside us. I just got absolutely wasted right there. I have to say, when they duck to cover, it actually messes me up a little bit now because they're they're juking my shots. That's pretty impressive. All right, let's try the assault. Let's try the PPSH, a classic weapon. A classic. We're gonna go third person again because I seem to do best with this. All right, and the, the the close quarters. This is where the PPSH will reign supreme. Of course, I'm firing at a distance right when I'm like, okay, we're gonna switch to close quarters because of all the close quarters, and then boom. Everyone's far away. All right, we're going to yield the grenade that way. We're going to spam those guys. They grenaded back. Okay. No. Oh, I couldn't stay in the same spot because of the grenade, but then crossing over was just a death sentence. Oh, not good, dude. Not good at all. We are, we are struggling. It's this final point, man. It really is this final point. All right, spawning it. Come on, baby. Let's get this bread. All right, yote that out there. Yote th Go to fit. Beautiful, beautiful. Okay. Reload real quick. We push up. We got allies. We got allies. They are in the buildings, though. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Yeah, there's nothing. There's nothing we could do from that angle. All right, we got to go on the left. Let's go around the flank. Try and flank around the boutique. All right, yeah, we're going left side this time. Keep going right side. That's what they're expecting. That's what they want us to do, boys. But we shall not. Alpha jet for such go. Beautiful. Alright, push up. Okay. Yeah. You better die. Beautiful. Oh, they're actually trying to take this. We're gonna What was that? <laughs> what how'd I die? Is that my old soldier killed me? That's so tragic. Alright. Let's go in as the commissar. That way we can get the artillery. Artillery. Yeah, we'll try and save up for the artillery. That could be big. If we get the artillery and then we push in, that could result in some big boom booms. Some big wipeout boom booms. Oh, what a shot. Oh, is this one of those action one shots? Yeah, buddy. Oh, this is what I like to see. Get the one shot kill with it. T21 moving in. We need that tank support. Yeah. Turn around. Go this way, buddy. Come on. I just grenaded for no reason, but hey. Sorry. Uh -oh. There we go. There we go. I was actually surprised I hit that shot. I didn't think I did. Oh my god, I didn't hit that shot. Okay. There we go. Eh. Oh, I'm out of ammo. That's why. Okay, run away. Just for the time being. Grenade. Oh, no! We did get the grenade off, though. I don't know if it'll do anything. I have no idea if it did anything. Yeah, I really don't know right there. Wow. Okay. This is the toughy dude. Alright, we are winning by a good bit. I mean, they... They have one point left. It's just this last point is like straight up impossible for us to get, bro. All right, let's just yote that down. Down range big time. There you go. There you go. Uh-oh. Come on. What? Okay, that guy was phasing through that window. All right, we'll just yote another. Actually, that might kill our ally right there. That'd be rough. Okay, I don't think it did. A lot of explosions. Lots of Kirsch Flerschensch. Okay, push up. Gotta get to the street, baby. Grenade that doorway. Okay, my grenade missed by a wide margin. Alright. Climb up here. Okay. Uh, can we? Like, is this possible? I don't even know. Alright, you know what? We're just gonna go ahead and press Q right there. Smoke signal out. Throw a grenade in there. Push up, push up. No! 
think I killed myself actually with the artillery strike, maybe. But let's hope it. I don't. I don't even know if it was effective, dude. I just don't even know. It might have been. It might have been. They only have 29 soldiers left, so that's not too shabby. It ain't too bad. Ow. Ow. God, that was bad. That was a roughie. <laughs> that was me being real. Not impressive in the slightest. Okay. <laughs> Not great, dude. Alright, we push in deeper. Skirt! Throw that grenade out there. Nice. Good kill. Alright, they're doing a massive pushback right now. Alright, we successfully ended that. That was a brutal grenade, honestly. That was a headshot and didn't kill right away. Okay. Oh, gotta reload. That's why. Alright, we'll grenade again. We have grenades, like, out the wazoo. They really, uh, give us a lot of those. I think I just killed myself. Again. I think I did it again. Oops, I did it again, boys. Rip, rip, potato chip. Okay, they only have three soldiers left. So, like, this should be the dub right here. This should be dubski wubski bill. Come on. Come on, boys. One final push. Ooh, charge for the Russians. Jeez. Okay, they have zero troopers left, so that means we just have to get in there, kill the remaining troopers. They have zero reinforcements, should I say. Um, we just need to kill the remaining forces of theirs and take the street. That's literally... He just killed me! You just ran me over! You... You really did it to me, huh? You really just decided to run me over like that, huh? That's epic. Oh, look. Do we take this point? No, it's... Oh, there we go. We did it. All right. We got 71 kills, 21 deaths. Not the worst ever. Not the best. Thank you guys so much for watching. This was an awesome map. I loved this. This was great. This was really great. Thank you guys so much for watching. Subscribe if you haven't already. Hit the like button and comment down below. I'll see you on the next one. Peace. I hope you guys enjoyed that video. Be sure to click that subscribe button for more content. And hit the notification bell if you'd like to be alerted to whenever I live stream or upload. Thanks so much.